Hey babe, what you doing? Burning stuff. Burning stuff. That's why I think day three. <laughs> burning a bush. bush. Bur burning the bush. Brush. Burning sure. the brush. Sure. Yeah. Not gonna, not gonna be burning the the bush anytime soon. No. What? <laughs> so dumb. Thank you, Willow. back on a different day. I'm waiting on the parents to get here. Yep, they're on their way. Yep, they're about halfway here. So another like five more hours. So we got to clear this out so mom can bring her stuff in here. Yep, this is where they're, the tent and washer and dryer washer and dryer yeah so you gotta knock out yeah. some trunks laundry room yeah like a little laundry room back there even though i have a, a beat up wash washer <clears throat> all right <coughs> smoke <laughs> it aggravated my throat but yeah my washer's seen better days my dryer's okay though so. yeah. but my washer just goes th -thum, th -thum, th -thum. yeah so yeah. Crazy stuff. Either way, it'll do. And then when mom gets here, there's going to be a lot of, a lot of doing. Mm -hmm. Which y'all will see that in another video. A, a lot of um, blowing cash into the wind. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. It hurts, but it's for a good cause. <laughs> but yeah, so just working. Working. <laughs> How about you, babe? <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, I'm taking all of the the bigger stuff and taking it over to the other pile that we'd already had. The bigger bushes. The the bigger bushes and trees and, and such, getting this more cleared out. Yeah, but and we're dusted in. And what are we dusted in? The the seven dust. Why? Because there's a lot of ticks. No, because that's area. called Tick Town. Tick Town. Yeah, in back of the RV, it's called Tick Town. Yeah. So. Yeah, this is Tick Town. So, so they're getting. <laughs> yeah. They're vacating the premises. Yeah. But. Yeah. I'm gonna go through and I'll, I'll show you guys some footage from a few days ago, because obviously we had weather and uh, stuff that. It's going on that we've already talked about, you know, in previous videos and, and such. Yeah, but we'll see you in the next video. Yeah, and you guys will see that coming up soon. But right now, we need to get busy because we're running out of time. Because I think all of next week is more rain. Yeah. <laughs> I'm over that part. Yep, me too. So let's get to work. Yep.
We had a friend come to join us while we were working. He actually came over here earlier and then went down the road a little ways with some of the dogs across the street. And you can hear them like they went all the way around the property, all the way going up towards National Forest. And then he ended up coming back through the property from the front gate and then has been laying down over by the trailer. But now Gladys had been raking this up. We're almost done. But now he's laying over there and we're hoping that uh, he didn't come here to to pass away. Because <laughs> we, we did look at his tag. He is from down the road a little bit off of our road. But I know sometimes dogs do that, and Gladys has actually mentioned that. I didn't even think about it, but some dogs will run away to go find a place to, to lay down, not on their property. And hopefully that's not the case here, but we'll keep an eye on it. We already called the owner. He's been whining. And, uh, yeah, he's been, been whining whenever he lays down and, and such. We can't tell you that he's older, so we'll see what happens. All right, you guys, so today is just about done with all the burning that needed to happen. So I'm still here babysitting piles. We got two of the leaf piles and then the one pile back there where I was burning all the, the bigger stuff. But it's just about down now. Glass actually ran into town to get fuel for the truck. And then she's going to swing back by and pick me up so we can head back to the house. So... Uh, another day closer. Uh, I wish it was a little more for you guys. Uh, we were wanting to be able to get the tent put up over here today, but just was not in the cards for today. But hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, we can get back out here tomorrow, get the tent set up. Parents are clearing out the property. Start in a five. Hey, I'm a dad. We need for making the house. Yeah. Yeah. Mom and dad helping out clearing their piece of land for their home. They're excited to come and live here. Okay, we'll see how it goes. Hey guys, we are Thanks eating me. corn. Hey, send me a piece of that. Guys. Right. Mom and Yeah, uh, uh, Mom says hello. There's the fajitas. It says open the beans, but I don't have a can opener. <laughs> There's a knife. So yeah. So this is what we've been doing. We just finished burning and clearing some stuff out. Yep. Yeah. So. Working on a Sunday. Yum yum. Um, Mom is claiming, Mom is cl claiming her space, so we're we're burning down trees. Uh -oh. We don't have a what? A what? A can opener? No. I don't. So we're we're looking for the infamous can opener. They want to use that. I don't think that's gonna work. But nice try, guys. No one's their food. No one's their food. <laughs> right. He's gonna go look for one. Just finished eating and now we're back to work. Just pulling little things, not working very hard. Some of the kids sitting. Dad over there. And fire. Yeah. We're staying busy and we're doing good, but next week it's going to be a little different on the schedule. I'm going to post as we can because obviously we're not going to be in town. We're going to be out of town uh, for a few days. Okay. 
But just know that a lot of projects are coming, and I definitely appreciate y'all. Remember, share us out to your friends. Help us grow. It's greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and you made it this far. I greatly appreciate that. And remember, last but not least, always thank a veteran at every chance you get, not only on Veterans Day. And we'll see you later, y'all.